if I could set up a trail cam to hit that, because there's a trail there, but look where we are. Like, again, if I didn't have a dog, this is so sketchy in here. Let's go, let's go up here. Our trail cameras are up through there. And as I, yeah, if I didn't have a dog, I wouldn't be doing this. Not this route, I'd be in here, but you can even sort of see there's been a beaten down trail here. Let's go, Poppy. And there's no shortage of raspberries around. Like we're right in Berry, Berry Heaven. Let's go. What if your name was Berry Heaven? And actually here, you can just see that something's knocked. Yeah, there's definitely been a bear in here. Come on, let's go. Try to make extra noise. Oh yeah, he's been... Whoa. Come on, Poppy, let's go. Let's go up this way. Let's make lots of noise. We don't want to surprise a big bear. Holy smokes, that guy, that bear just trampled all this stuff. So many good berries in here. So, that's kind of a cool thing. But I think he turned around, because now we have to bushwhack. Come on, fellas. I got nobody with me. Oh. Um, as we talk loud, I mean, look at this. I should not be in here. <laughs> I'm not trying to be dramatic, but it's like, really, you know, chance of seeing a bear is all percentages. Right now, you try to keep the percentages low depending on your, what you're doing. Wow. Um, so I wasn't feeling good last weekend, but I did a big run. It's Saturday the 27th. I did a big run yesterday and it felt amazing. So I'm back in business, baby. Holy cow. These just came on like crazy. Um, you probably recognize this a bit more. That's where our cameras are. I don't like to trample all the, look how nice this all looks. I try to avoid doing that. So anyway, there was a bear there and I thought maybe he came up here, which would be great because he might be on our cameras. Um, yeah, so I felt really good yesterday. We got to get some dogs here. Come on, guys. Pup, pup. They're just eating berries. That's what they love. So my neighbor came over with a ton of cat food. They've given up on the finding their cat. I feel so bad. She was crying and yeah. So I'm pretty sure the cat was sick. The more I hear about it, I don't think anything got it. There's Rupert. Hey, buddy. You need one set of noses up here, better than mine. What do you think? Anyway. I was gonna talk about the Olympics and how Canada's soccer team cheated and how everybody cheats. And when it's Russia and China, you, you say, oh, that's to be expected. But anybody with any level of success at the Olympics, there's a huge percent of chance that they're cheating. Just saying, which just taints the whole thing. And I'll make a prediction. I think the Kenyan uh, athletes, track athletes, are the worst or the most prevalent cheaters so they're more likely to get caught so you just watch there'll be kenyans that get caught because the the payoff is just way so much worth it financially and well same for an american you win the 100 meters man you you're a multi-millionaire okay on that happy note let's uh <laughs> let's check things out our battery's pretty low so we want to keep it in case we see a bear